It's my side or no side, ain't no in-betweens All my niggas serve that fatty, we just want the green Load up them yappers, broad day, if you play with me Yeah, yeah, fuck my enemy It's my side or no side, ain't no in-betweens All my niggas serve that fatty, we just want that green Load up them yappers, broad day, if you play with me Yeah, yeah fuck my enemy Play with my paper, I don't care, bitch, I'm a bush, yeah. We got Jacobs, we got y'all, but shit, we in for red. If you play, I swear to God, and I'm gonna send them there. Yeah. Ooh, she helping out the punch. She made it. Ooh, ooh you running out of room. Yes, it's good. I'm going to What's going on, Bully Fam? Queen City Bullies, Aaron checking in. We back again with another video. Man, today, make sure y'all stay tuned all the way to the end of the video. We got a lot going on, man. We're going to show y'all a lot of puppies we got available for sale. We're going to show y'all some upcoming greetings that we got about to go down. And we're going to do an update on the French Bulldogs, y'all. We got the Frenchies out right now. Matter of fact, we got the gang out. I ain't even going to lie to y'all. But we ain't before. Before I show y'all the dogs, real quick, I want to give y'all a reminder. We is raffling off this beautiful No Limit Daughter black and white. No Limit Daughter, y'all. Make sure y'all tap in. Go to the website, queencitybullies.com. $50 will give you a chance to win that girl. Or you can get three for 100 Make sure you go on the website right now. QueenCityBullies.com. I'm going to post some pictures, videos of this beautiful black and white No Limit Daughter. Y'all check her out. The raffle will go down at the beginning of May. We're running out of time, so make sure you tap in. Grab one, grab three, grab six, whatever you want to do. Increase your chances to win that girl. As you see, she's low to the flow, and she's ready to go, y'all. So we're going to get right into it, though. Let's walk this way. Uh -oh. As y'all can see, we got quite a few puppies out here. Um, we got some keepers out here. We got some pups that's already sold. We're gonna be going to their new home soon. And we also got some pups that's gonna be available. So I'm gonna start with the pups that's gonna be available for sale. Um, I'm gonna drop my phone number down here at the bottom of the screen. You see anything you like, make sure you shoot me a text, give me a call. Let's make it happen. These pups are ready to go. Some of them are four months. Uh, and some of them are like approaching three months. So we're gonna get right into it. I'm gonna, uh, should I step in here? Or just grab them out. Mm, I would grab them out. Yeah, all right. So I want y'all to uh, get a quick overhead look at them so you can see them. As y'all see, though, they hanging out. They chilling out, man. They all looking good. I'm going to pull them out and let y'all see. Like I said, I'm going to start with the one that is uh, available. So since this girl right here is hanging out chilling, I'm going to show her first this beautiful lilac trap female right here. This is a believed daughter. I'm going to put her up on the table so y'all can see her. Look at this girl right here. She is four months. This girl was born in December, yeah, so she's four months. Walk over here. This was actually uh, my first pick female out of the litter that I just did with Believe and Beloved. But uh, I decided I'm gonna let her go, so I'm gonna stack her up right here, let y'all get a good look at her. She is beautiful, as you can see, she low to the pump. She's compact, that's for sure. She got a beautiful headpiece on her. Look at Maybach trying to get to her. So she's scared. This is her first time being on the table for real. But she looking real good, as you can see. If I hold her up for y'all, you can see how compact and short she is. She got a real nice rear end on her. She look good. Like I said, this is my first uh, my first pick out of the Believe in Beloved litter. But I decided to go ahead and let her go. As you can see, she's beautiful though. 
Lilac try, you can't go wrong with that color, man. She looking real, real good. She don't really want to stack up on the table. Yeah, but I do want y'all to see how beautiful she is, though, for sure. As you can see, uh, she four months, still low to the flow. She's still low to the flow, so she's not going to get much bigger. She just going to, uh, that bone going to come in, that neck and shoulder is going to come in, and she's going to thicken out. But she ain't going to get too much taller, as y'all know, man. We're shortening everything up. We're taking everything all the way, all the way low to the flow with it, man. But as you see, this beautiful girl, she got a clean bike, everything. She's super nice, full tail, neck and shoulders. Y'all know we stamp them with the neck and shoulders over here, man. Beautiful, beautiful female. Stop, stop, stop. They trying to take my table down, y'all. But yeah, go keep it rolling, though. Look at this girl right here, though. She's super nice, super nice. Lilac track, believe daughter right here. Make sure you tap in if you're interested in this girl. Like I said, she's four months old. She is off of the Believe and Beloved Litter, so she is two times Believe. Look at that right there, man. Y'all make sure y'all tap in, get in where you fit in. I'm going to keep it stepping, though. We got quite a few cups that I want to show y'all that's going to be available. So if you see something you like, make sure you tap in. Next up, since her sister came right to me, I'm actually going to show y'all. This is her litter mate sister right here. Blue Tribe Believe daughter litter mate to the first female I just showed y'all. She's going to also be available. Look at this girl right here. Super nice female. Really remind me of her mama and her dad. Y'all know they both blue tribes. She looks just like them. Looking super good. She low to the flow too. Like I said, they four months old. They four months old. Super compact. Correct. Clean as can be. You see this girl, she looking real good. She got that headpiece just like her dad. Nice bone on this girl. Like I said, they low to the flow still. You see it though. Nice paws on her. It's real windy out here. Hopefully y'all can still hear me, but look at this girl. She looking super good. Super good. Thick as can be. Neck and shoulders. Beautiful. Beautiful female. Yes, sir. All right. We're gonna go next. All right, I'm gonna show this girl next. She walked up, so she's going next. This is actually the biggest pup that we got. This is the biggest pup that we got available, as y'all can see, she's swole, though. Look at this girl right here. This is Incredible Daughter, off of the Incredible and the Lila Litter. Y'all know from the last video, I showed y'all her brother that went out to Houston. I met my guy uh, halfway in Arkansas. He got that boy. But look at this girl. Like I told y'all, man, Incredible been putting it down. It's incredible season. That's the fact that I think this girl is. She is four months old as well. She's just four months old. Look at her though. She ain't never been up on a table either. But one thing about her though, she thick as can be structured out. As you see, she got that chest on her. I like this girl a lot. It's gonna break my heart to let her go. Uh, but if y'all interested in this girl, I will be interested in doing a co-on on this girl. So if y'all wanna buy this girl outright, you can, but I will be interested in a co-own opportunity for this girl. Like I said, this is an incredible daughter. She four months, look how thick she is. She low to the flow too. Uh, with her being at this age, I'm not sure she's gonna get much bigger than what she is, like I said. Yeah. She, uh, she, she four months old. She like four and a half months old, but look how thick she is though. She's super thick, y'all. She compact, full tail now. Let me show the tail, full tail. Nice thick tail, beautiful head piece on her. Lilac track. Can't go wrong, like I said, this girl is available. You get the number at the bottom of the screen. I also would be interested in uh, co-owning this girl right here. So if you want to work with me, we can work it out. This girl definitely take your program to the next level. Just look at how thick she is, man. She off the chain for me. Okay, so we're gonna keep it stepping though. We're gonna keep it stepping. Next up, I'm gonna show y'all. Sorry, girl. Next up, we're gonna show y'all another incredible daughter, man. This is another incredible daughter that we got available. As you can see, once again, she a little bit younger. I wanna say she like uh, almost three months. She approaching three months, but as you can see, she's super thick. She's super thick as well. She got a beautiful headpiece on her, that lilac that came in on her real good. So the, the other incredible daughter is a lilac tri. This girl is fully lilac. So she's not tri, but she lilac though. So she definitely got color for days. Look at that girl right there, man. Beautiful. Y'all stop. It's the Frenchie. <laughs> Cut it out. Cut it out. <laughs> Get 
see and off on whoever she see, ain't you? <laughs> stop doing that. You stop that. That's what you just got knocked over. <sighs> but yeah, this girl right here is an incredible daughter, beautiful. Thick as can be, as you can see, Incredible definitely been throwing that bone and that body around. Everything that he been producing has been having bone on it. I'm gonna post some pictures of a female from his very first litter that he produced. Super nice female. I know y'all remember that girl, Blue. I had her for quite some time. Y'all slept on her. Don't sleep on these Incredible Daughters. Like I said, man, he definitely, definitely throwing it down. It's incredible season. Look at this girl right here. She got a beautiful rear end on her, beautiful top line on her. I showed y'all this girl like a week or so while she had her ears, but that next day, she did get her ears done, so her ears is pretty much fully healed now. She ready to go. Lilac, as you can see, like I said, she boned up. This is an incredible daughter, y'all. This is incredible. Uh, so this is that Young Believe Nation meets that Shamrock Blood. Shout out to my guy, Marcus over there at Stay Down Kennels. We did a collaboration uh, to produce this girl, man. She is beautiful, as you can see. She got that nice chest piece. She got the bone, the paws, everything that's, that's stamped by that Young Believe Nation, man. Make sure y'all tap in this girl right here. Both of the Incredible Daughters, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Both of the Incredible Daughters, the Lilac track that I just showed y'all, and also this Lilac female right here, they both are available. But if you're interested in doing a co-own, I will be open to doing a co-own on both of those females. Like I said, look at this right here. It break my heart to sell or let these girls go. As you can see, they got everything that will take somebody program to the next level. They thick as can be. They got powerful rear ends, neck and shoulders on these girls. Everything that you wanna see on a young pup. She got a big head on her. She definitely, definitely, she definitely gonna be nice. For sure, for sure. She got them eyes. This lilac girl gonna be super nice and that lilac trap. Both of these incredible daughters, like I said, man, up the program up or we can work together, do a co-own and we can make that happen too. All right, next up, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, okay. Believe it or not, y'all, this the one that's making all the ruckus over there. This little girl right here, she the smallest thing in the kennel right now. So I showed y'all the pups that's gonna be available for right now. So I showed y'all what we got available. Next up, I'm gonna start showing, doing some updates on the pups that's gonna be uh, going to their new homes. And then I'll show y'all a few of the pups that I decided that I'm gonna keep introducing a few of them to the channel to y'all as well. So this girl right here, Pie Ball, uh, uh, Pie Ball Blue and Tan female right here. She is going to, I wanna say Portland. Yeah, she's gonna be going to Portland. Me and my guy gonna be co-owning this girl, so I'm waiting on him to uh, book his flight, get booked out here. He's gonna pull up on me, grab her, and we're gonna work out the co-own deal on her, this beautiful female right here. I just wanted to quickly do an update on her, because in the last video, she was available, but uh, since then, she has been spoken for. Beautiful girl right here, as you can see. Nice little stance on her. I like, the, I like her face. Look at that girl right there. She's doing a little bit better than the bullies, a little bit. I'm, I'm a little bit jealous. Look at that right there. Short back on this girl. She looking real good. I want to say she is uh, about approaching. I don't know. I want to say she might be approaching like three months. Stop. I'm not really sure. I think she might be approaching like three months as well. But she looking real good. Looking healthy. She good and ready to go too. Like I said, I'm just waiting on my guy to get his uh, flight situated, and then we gonna work it all the way out from there, man. So y'all stay tuned. This girl right here, y'all already know. Stay tuned to the end of the video. Like I've been telling y'all, we building up and building out our uh, French Bulldog program. So like I said, I'm doing a co-own with this girl. I'm gonna be showing y'all our entire French Bulldog program that we got here. Y'all know we just got a few dogs, but I'm gonna show them all to y'all today. So make sure y'all stay tuned to the end of the, uh, end of the video. All right, who wanna be next? You walking up on me. This girl right here, this beautiful girl right here, she also is a troublemaker, no lie. This beautiful black female right here is off of the Believe and Brown Sugar 2.0 breeding that we did. Um, we decided to run that breeding back. We actually was trying to run that breeding back for quite some time, but we finally got it on the flow. And this is what they threw down for us, man. Beautiful black female right here, short and compact, nice rear end. The consistency that the Young Believe Nation be throwing is unreal. We're gonna step over here. I'm gonna show y'all her with the sun that came out for this beautiful black girl right here. Y'all check her out though. She's super nice. She will be going to her new home uh, this weekend. She going to her new home. Shout out to my guy, Tune. He gonna be coming to get her from Florida. He flying in. We, 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 we flying them in, flying them out, however we gotta do it, man. Let's work together, whatever. But my guy, Tune, he coming from Florida to pick her up. He gonna fly in and grab her this weekend. This beautiful black female right here, as you see, she compact as can be too, looking real good. These pups that we got, 
available and the ones that we letting go, y'all, they top tier, they A1, they top notch. Make sure you tap in. It's time to start up in your camp, improving your yard, man. So why not start right here at Queen City Village? Y'all know we home with the neck and shoulders. We've been throwing it down for years. The consistency is right in your face. We show it to y'all video after video. So I'm gonna go move on and show y'all who we gonna show next. Okay, that boy over there. I might have to step in to get him, y'all. They gonna attack me, but that's cool. Move your head out the way, man. All right. All right, so, so this is the long, this is the lonely male out of the bunch, y'all. This is the only male that we got, but he is going to Canada, y'all. This male right here is out of the Believe and Brown Sugar Litter as well. He's super nice, y'all. I ain't gonna lie, I wanted to keep this boy, um, but my guy from Canada, he hit me up. We worked it out. He he wanted this male bad, so we worked it out, man. We're gonna be shooting out to Canada in the upcoming weeks to send this boy off to his new home. Y'all, we making major moves. Y'all see this boy, he real nice. He gonna be something nice, man. He gonna put on for Canada. He gonna put on for Queen City Bullies. Yes, sir, look at that right there, man. Neck and shoulders on swell. I ain't gonna put him on the table because I had to come in here to get him, so I don't even wanna- Stop, stop. I don't even wanna go back out uh, again, so. Y'all see him, though, he's super nice. I'm gonna put him down so he can kind of walk around. Y'all can see him. Stop. Ah, I told y'all they was gonna attack me, but. <laughs> yeah, he looking real good. Uh, next up, real quick, just real quick, real quick, I'm gonna show y'all some of the pups that uh, that I'm holding back that I'm keeping for myself. So I'm gonna start off with this girl. This girl right here, if y'all remember, this is Believe and Karma's daughter. Out of the Believe and Karma litter, we took Believe uh, to Karma, which is a Believe daughter. So this is two times Believe. Right here, beautiful female. Believe it or not, she three months, y'all. She gonna be micro. Y'all know her mama was a micro. And she... I don't know, me and Marcus been talking about it. I think she might end up being smaller than her mama, y'all. So be on the lookout, lookout for this girl. Like I said, man, we going all the way, all the way low to the flow with it. I'm going to put her down so y'all can see how little she is. She's super small, y'all. She's super small. She's super small. They all over me. Stop, 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 stop. Next up, I'm going to show y'all this girl right here. This is a No Limit Daughter right here. Look at this beautiful girl right here. No Limit Daughter with a full tail, as you can see. She's short and compact, short and stubby legs on her. You know what I mean? I kind of want to stack her up though. Plus they're tearing me up in here. I'm going to come up out of here. Hey. Tearing my ass up, boy. That'd be a little good. That'd be a little good. Huh? All right, so man, I had to come up out of there. It's fucking me up, so. Check it out though. Right here, we got this No Limit Daughter right here. She is beautiful, fine. I don't know if she's stable, fine, whatever. I got her from my guy over there at, uh, my guy, Lou Scotty, over there at Big Time Pendles, man. This girl right here, No Limit Daughter. I want to sh show y'all how short and compact this girl is, though, man. I don't know, y'all. Talk to me. Should I keep this girl, sell her? Should I keep her? Look at her. She low to the flow, compact for sure. You see that girl, man. She definitely cold, short to the side. Wow. Short back. Mm -hmm. She got that short back. She boned up for days, man. Y'all know No Limit definitely throw neck and shoulders. Yeah. Miss the neck and shoulders, you heard me? That bone. <laughs> y'all see it, man. She's super nice, though. I'm kind of torn, though, y'all. I'm kind of torn. I've been telling y'all for so long now. I'm trying to keep the numbers down. I'm trying to keep the numbers down. It's killing me to sell some of these puppies, for real. I want to keep, like, probably 80% of the puppies that I showed y'all that's going to their new home, but mm. I, just, I just can't do it. So. <laughs> I just can't do it. So, But look at this girl right here. Seriously, seriously. Considering keeping this girl, she uh, she about to be three months old. She about to be three months old, and just look at how little she is, man. She's super small. She looks just like her daddy too, man. Yes, yeah, sir. Y'all know we trying to uh, build out our micro exotic program as well. So we trying we trying to do it all, man. We trying to hit them at all angles. Y'all know how we do it over here, man. We ain't gonna play no games with them. It's a beautiful girl right here, though. It's a beautiful girl. She got that mug on her. Ooh, she got that mug on her. I don't know. She might need a name, y'all. She might need a name, man. Her and her sister Touch might have to do damage for us over here, man. All right, we're going to move along. We're going to move along. We're going to move along, y'all. Let's see. What's up, baby? What's up, baby? I might have saved the best for last for y'all. I ain't going to lie to y'all. This girl right here, this is 
Incredible Daughter. Y'all see it, man. Two times believe, Incredible Daughter. I took Incredible to uh, believe, Daughter. Lime Bread. Lime Bread, believe, Incredible Daughter right here. She looking just like her daddy. Look at that right there, man. I've been saying that I've been wanting it since I had Incredible, like I want to produce a female just like him. Nice, thick, boned up chocolate girl. Y'all know I got that sweet tooth, man. Come on over here. Walk over here with me, y'all, so y'all can see this girl, man. She looking crazy. Like I said, man, we did it again, man. Oh, you ain't gonna stand up for me. See, I done hyped you up. Now you don't want to do right. Come on. <laughs> but y'all see it, though, man. She looking real good. She looking real good, man. Nice head piece on this girl. She got that chocolate thing going on, looking beautiful. I'm closer so y'all can see her. This is gonna be a beautiful girl right here. She might be here for the long haul, too. Like I said, this is incredible daughter, two times believe. She gonna build out our program, take it to the next level. Uh, that girl and this girl right here, these my two, these my two, two times believe. Uh, we got a believe daughter and an incredible daughter right here, so. Y'all talk to me, man. I need names for these girls right here. They most definitely, definitely, definitely gonna take us to the next level, man. Y'all see it. It's that young Believe Nation right here, man. Incredible. And Believe. Pups right here. Look at that. She hard-headed. She don't, she don't want to do right, but y'all see it, man. Y'all see it. One of them, super short, compact on the micro side. This one right here, neck and shoulders, swole up for days, like I said. She gonna pack that bone, that body. Man, y'all know how we do it, man. All right, so for real, for real, that's it for the pups. I'll show y'all a quick glance at them one more time so y'all can see how good they looking. But uh, from there, we are gonna move on to the French Bulldogs, y'all. We are gonna move on to the Frenchies. It's time, man, it's time. All right, so over here. Over here, we got our French Bulldogs out, man. We got my girl, Whitney. We got Maybach right here. We got Milkshake. And we got my girl, Nike, right here. So, what's up, big boy? Y'all know I love my boy, Maybach, big Maybach right here. He getting so, he getting so big. I picked him up first, because he probably gonna do the best on the table. The other ones ain't gonna, they ain't gonna wanna be up there at all, so. Y'all see it, man. This is my big boy, Maybach. My chocolate and tan French Bulldog stud. He 10 months old now. He just 10 months. He will be uh, doing his first in-house breeding real soon, y'all. So I've been getting a lot of people inquiring, asking me about French Bulldog pups. Matter of fact, I will have, I, I am, I do have a, a female available. I'm gonna show y'all her next, so. Look at this boy right here. Love my boy in Maybach, man. I'm super excited. I'm actually gonna run him to my girl, uh, Whitney, see what they do. I'm gonna put that chocolate and tan on that black and tan. Let's see what that do, man. Look at that boy right there. He getting thick. Like I said, he's 10 months. I'm gonna put my boy to work. Y'all wanna be up here at Maybach? Mm -mm. It's cool. It's cool. y'all see it, man. First mm -hmm. boy dog, Maybach. Queen City Bullies production right here out of my first litter. He's super chocolate and tan, Merle. As y'all see it, man. Add that color to your camp, man. Yes, sir. We working. I got him open at 1500. So, tap in. Uh, let's see. Next up, I'm gonna show y'all his sister. Don't run for me. Don't you run for me. Don't you run for me. So, I've been uh, up, and, up and up on the fence about this for several months now. I actually, I actually had her sold once. And then the guy never, uh, the guy never came through and got her, so I ended up deciding to keep her. But now that my girl Whitney over here, now that Whitney is of age and she about to be coming in heat, I'm like I said, I'm gonna take my boy Maybach to Whitney. So I done finally, finally made up my mind for real this time, y'all. I'm gonna let my girl uh, Milkshake go. She is a pie. Chocolate and tan Merle, you can see the Merle right here. You can see the chocolate on her face. That's why I call her uh, Chocolate Milkshake. Cause she white, but then she got all this color going on with the Merle, the chocolate and all that. She ain't gonna stand up right on the table. I ain't even gonna do her like that. They ain't, they ain't really never been up on the table, but I'm gonna put her down. Y'all can kind of just see her on the ground right there. She is available though. 
if y'all interested in her. Um, she would actually be another dog that I would possibly be interested in doing a co-own with. So if you're interested in her, you can buy her outright or if you want to do a co-own. The only thing about the co-own situation is, stop me, babe. Stand up. Hey, the only thing about the co-own situation is, if we do the co-own, I want to take her to a, uh, to a Isabella and Tan. So if you do the co-own, we got to take her to a Is Isabella and Tan. I'm trying to produce uh, some pie. Isabella and Tans, and possibly some Pi Isabella and Tan murals. I don't know. I just, for some reason, I just think that that'd be hard. So that's the goal for her. You can buy her outright, do whatever you want to do with her. But if we do a co-own, then I do want to take her to a Isabella and Tan. So with that being said, we're going to move right along. Next up, I'm going to show y'all probably one of the fan favorites for real, for real. All my friends, but she always runs with me. Where do you want from me? Y'all like me? Do you want <laughs> I definitely ain't gonna stack her up because she don't like me picking her up, so I ain't gonna stack her up. But this right here is, this is Mikey, chocolate and tan tweed, Murrow. This is Maybach's sister. Y'all see it. Matter of fact, let's see what she does. Why not? Let's see how she do on the team. But yeah, I got big plans for her too. I've been uh, kind of stud searching for her. I don't know what I'm gonna take her to. Nah, she don't wanna be up here neither. Stand up, girl. Stand up, girl. But they really coming out of their linky stage. They just hit 10 months. I've been noticing they, they starting to get a little bit thicker. Their head pieces is really starting to uh, turn out the way I wanna start to see them. But we, we uh, bought Whitney at a young age and raised her up. So we kinda got a feel for how they grow and mature now. It take time, you gotta let the let the blood kind of work itself and after a while they really start to come around just like with the bullies the bullies go through linky stages so do the uh so do the frenchies but this girl's super heavy she's starting to get her grown woman on she's 10 months old i can't wait to see what she do for us over here she you know, little fat little thing though she heavy she probably the bigger one out of out of them yeah she most definitely the bigger one maybe because a little more on the shorter and compact side but when I breed her, when I breed Nike, I'm gonna take her to a more shorter, more compact sub. We're gonna shorten it up even more, but we're gonna keep the color there. Y'all know I got to have my color now. So we're gonna keep it with the color, but we're gonna still shorten it up, make it more compact, put even more breed type into them. But then at the same time, we're gonna keep the color. I might take her to an Isabella and Tan too. I don't know, I've been looking at them Isabella and Tans, and that's really what I like. I know the game been going uh, with the fluffies and all of this. I'm probably gonna work, work my way into the fluffy game, but as far as with them, I'm, a, I'm thinking I'm going to take them to the Isabella and Tans. That's just the move that I want to run with them. Who knows? We might pop out with a Fluffy sooner or later. Y'all stay tuned, man. Uh, next up, I'm going to show y'all this big girl right here. Like I said, she a year old. You so small, bro. <laughs> I love this girl right here. This was my, uh, this was the girl that I bought as a pup. We raised her up. She a year old now, as you can see. She thick, y'all. She think I got her on that bully diet. I got her on that bully diet, y'all. I be feeding her the same thing I feed the bulls. She eating the same amount, all that. So I don't know if it's, I don't know if she just grown and matured and filled out to be like this, or if it's because I got her on that bully diet. But she got bone, she got body. This girl right here, she's super nice, y'all. This is my girl, uh, Whitney. I'm sure some of y'all probably remember her when I first got her when she was a pup, but she definitely, she definitely uh, full grown now. My wife love her to death. My wife loved her. She loved how she turned out. Cause y'all, y'all know, like I said, man, they go through phases, y'all. They go through phases. She was at some, at one point, we were just like, I don't know, like I don't know, cause like this, this was our first time raising up a French bulldog for real. So just looking at her, not really knowing what we was looking at. But now that we had her, raised her up, and then now that we then produced our own litter and seen how they growing and maturing, it's just like I said, man, we in love with the Frenchies, y'all. We definitely in love with the Frenchies, like I told y'all. We got, we got our own thing going on over here. We got black and tan. We got chocolate and tan Merle. We got pied chocolate and tan. Once again, that girl Nike, the, the pied chocolate and tan Merle female, she is available. So you can tap in and purchase her. I'm gonna try to get some pictures of her. I have to give her a bath as y'all see. She filthy that white. And these uh, in the yard that I got with this gravel and everything, they just, they just really don't mix. She come out here and get dirty easy. So, but yeah, man, that's what we got going on. Over here, man, like I said, we got pups available for sale. They over here chilling, man. Y'all tap in. We got 
believe pups. We got incredible pups. Looking real, real good. And the thing about it too, the good thing for some of y'all, um, the believe pups and the incredible pups that I got available, they actually a little bit older. So as y'all see, they they fully vaccinated. So you ain't gotta worry about you know all that. They fully vaccinated. They ready to go. They four months. They they'll be coming in their first heat pretty soon. I then jump started the outside process. So if you get them on a good routine, they'll be able to be potty trained with no problem. They already getting the concept of coming out here, being outside. Like it, it feel real good out here. I just keep them water out here, keep them toys out here, let them get their exercise on as opposed to keeping them locked up and caged up because they got so much bone and body on them. I don't want them to be in a cage all day. I want them to exercise and get they and get they uh, and get that sun like they need that sun like so. Before we do head up out of here, just one more time, I gotta show y'all these pups. I'm super proud. It's so many different litters in here. Like we got the chocolate pup is is off of uh, incredible to crypto. The black and the black trap puppy is off of Parma and believe then you got the Frenchie right here you got this blue track girl right here believe daughter out of the believe and beloved litter then the, to her left you got the lilac try incredible daughter out of the incredible and the lilac litter y'all y'all get the picture man just no matter which litter you get a pup from i promise you you're gonna be satisfied i won't let you down i guarantee you y'all see these pups from the young ones the little small ones right here that's just uh i want to say they like eight weeks they they just now really old enough well no they nine weeks they got their second set of shots so they nine weeks they're gonna be going to their new home soon but these other pups that i still got available the reason why they still here is because i was holding them back to see like okay i really want to keep these pups but y'all know i just bred my girl sugar bear to that boy foot she looking promising what you think babe she looking promising she yeah. definitely looking promising so be on the lookout they i want to say it's been about two and a half weeks so in about another week and a half we will be uh, getting confirmation on that in another week and a half we will be getting confirmation on that y'all so y'all stay tuned for that uh oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah um i ain't gonna pull her out though right now because she's super in heat and, and the boy's been going crazy over her. But my girl Beloved, Beloved is in heat, y'all. Beloved is back in heat. She the, she the mom to this blue track girl right here and this lilac track girl that's over here balled up sleep. But she is back in heat and we are running her to none other than Queen City Bullies Incredible. So we right back at it again, y'all. This might be one of our best yet, man. We taking two of our best productions head to head they're going head to head, man, so you don't want to miss out. I'm going to walk over here and show y'all incredible. I ain't going to pull out Beloved, though, because like I said, Buddy been going crazy, man. Neck and shoulders on crazy time on this boy. Like I always, always, always tell y'all, videos, pictures, none of that ain't going to do the boy no justice. I showed y'all his daughter. She 10 months looking, so, oh, my God, she looking so crazy. That was blue. Y'all slept on blue. We had blue. How long we had blue for like seven months? Nah. Yeah, we had blue for like seven months. So I did a collaboration with my guy Russ over there at Claim Vision Bullies. Um, I got that girl blue as my pup back out of the deal. I had her for sale. I got her when she was like, what, three months? I got her when she was like three months. So we had her in total about three and a half months, probably going on four months. I kept showing her for sale. Nobody wanted to get her. Really none of y'all wasn't showing interest in her. However, now that y'all see how she looking, look, I'm gonna post her one more time, again, more time. so y'all can see how she looking. So, look, mm -hmm. I can't I can't put the spoon in your mouth and make you eat, man. All I can do is put the food on the table. It's up to you to eat, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, man, that boy incredible. He been putting it down, it's incredible season. It's a whole lot of bull right there, man. That's a whole lot of neck and shoulders. That's a whole lot of bone. That's a whole lot of beef on a short and compact frame. And y'all see it, I showed y'all several litters. He ain't got that many litters on the ground. I ain't gonna lie, sit here in front of y'all. He got maybe a handful of litters. And I done showed them all to y'all. And every litter he done had, they all got beef, bone, and body on a short and compact frame. So tap in, it's that Young Believe Nation, man. We've been putting it down. Oh, one more thing. I think I forgot to tell y'all something. I did. Matter of fact, let's walk back over here. We're going to end the video with you. Can't do it. I can't do it. You 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 can
Sabi po. This micro female right here, this belief daughter out of the Believe in Karma litter, she marks six generations of productions out of Queen City Bullies. So this is definitely that Young Believe Nation blood right here. That means we produce six generations of dogs that came from this dog. So we can go back way, 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 way back when. So what I basically did was put just about every one of my dogs into this dog. And the reason I wanted to mention that to y'all is because look how small and compact this girl is. If you just go all the way back seven years ago, six years ago, how big the dogs was, and then I started breeding on the smaller dogs, more compact dogs. And yeah, I was switching up my program, but at the same time, I was still kind of keeping my blood and working it at the same time, but bringing in what I needed to to make it better. But this right here is the results of all of that meshed into one. Y'all see it, man. She's stupid compact. Like I said, she's three months. Black try. She got everything in her, man. She got everything in her. That's how we do it over here, y'all. Make sure y'all tap in, man. Get with us. You see something you like, you see something you need. Make sure y'all tap in. The phone number will be at the bottom of the screen. Make sure y'all go to queencitybullies.com and get them tickets for that raffle, man. Don't miss out on that No Limit Dart. She looking real good. We can get our ears done. We didn't get our ears done. I was talking to my guy, Lou, right? Like, telling him I usually get all my puppies' ears done. But he said that he wanted to get a person that's getting the pup from him the opportunity to have a choice to get the puppies' ears done if they want. Not have to get the pup with the ears done because they already done. Because y'all know once they're gone, you can't get them back. So if you want the ears cut, we can have them cut for you. No problem at all. We definitely can make that happen for y'all. Look at this right here, though. Chocolate Tussie Roll, my guy. Y'all know I got that tweet tooth, man. We're gonna end the video right here, man. This girl right here is five yeah. months old, man. Five months old. No limit daughter. Play no games, man. Y'all see how we hitting them, man. From the Frenchies to the bullies to the micros, the exotics, whatever you want, man. We got what you need over here, man. We got it all available right now. Make sure y'all tap in. Get with us, man. I'm Aaron, Queen City Bullies. Like I said, my friends call me the dog father. Get with us, man. Let's make it happen. Yes, sir. We out of here.